The rise or drop string drill is a very effective way to see exactly where our pitch is breaking. It's a great way to work on your timing and release, as well as spin and rotation. Ideally, when throwing a drop or a rise, we want it to start breaking about three to five feet out in front of the plate. To execute the rise or drop string drill, start by setting up a string about five feet out in front of the plate. The string represents a point at which you want your ball to break. You'll want the string to be about chest high for rise balls and about knee high for drop balls. For the rise ball, our goal is to have the pitch break under the string and finish in the catcher's glove above the string. For the drop ball, it would be the opposite. Our goal is to get our pitch to break above the string and finish in the catcher's glove below the string. A fun way to challenge yourself in this drill is to see how many times out of 10 pitches you can get the ball to clearly break above the line with your rise ball and below the line with your drop ball. The string drill is a great visual tool for pitchers and really challenges them to focus on the details of each pitch.